Hello everybody, and welcome back to Electronic Superjoy Hardcore Strategy. Today we're going to be going over the boss stages, which is the Pope. Pope 2, Hyper Pope. Star League. And Pride. And also Sun Death, but that's really just a segue to the next level. You can look at uh, the other previous levels here in the annotations here, but uh, for right now, we're going to get started here. And starting off, you can see it's just a little introduction level to the boss. And as you can hear, uh, the Pope has gone insane. Oh, yeah. What about my control? Either way, he wants to kill us. So we have to kill him. Oh well. And this one isn't too difficult, just keep in mind that if you drop below that, you will die. And here's the boss. Now, starting off, you can notice the uh, world will shake there for a bit. That can actually throw people off uh, very easily, too. And you also want to keep going up as fast as you can. If you miss anything for, like, a little bit, you will probably uh, not be able to get back up. Because right here, that's where people usually get stuck. And right here, too, because people don't know how to jump properly. I do die quite a bit on this level, so I will be skipping through quite a bit. This is as close as I got so far before I uh, made it to the end. At least I believe so. Anyway, yeah. You can die pretty easily there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and skip forward. And talking over this will give me enough time to explain to you that, uh, uh when you jump on the stars, you usually want to jump in the center and not to stomp because then it'll be hard for you to get in the next area. And here we go, the perfect run. Welcome back, now we're going to start off with the first flying saucer level. These guys here give me a spaceship to ride in, as you can see, I'm very much excited. And right here in the music is going to be introducing uh, an old classical song. Now this part right here may seem pretty complicated when he's shooting at you, but really all you gotta do is just stay right above that one little bit right there and you should be fine. All you gotta do is just hold down the fire button. Well, see, even there, yeah, the music is pretty good, too. But yeah, you see there, you uh, shoot him and the lasers go. And it may seem like you can get hit the top there, but really, the hitbox is much smaller than it looks. And now, uh, right here, you'll see, yeah, see, right there. And now, as he moves up, you just gotta move at the same time, and now he's not shooting as much. This boss isn't really that hard. And now he runs away in fear, because I killed him. Not really. Now, right here is the part where things start actually getting pretty difficult uh, for you. Yeah, I'm out of gas, however, the Pope still has his uh, laser thing. And you're right there, you gotta collect those things as fast as you can. You also wanna try and stomp out any of the enemy's rockets as fast as you can as possible because they will continue uh, chasing you. And you also wanna avoid that laser as well. The placement of the rockets is random depending on where you are. And there you see I died right there. I thought you will die a lot on this level. I will guarantee you that. Um, yeah. So that little guy right there is going to keep shooting rockets uh, at him uh, as soon as... Uh, uh, when you pick them up. As you can see, the number of missiles in the screen is going to be too much and I die again. So we'll just uh, skip ahead and see where this takes us. I just wanted to point out here that once you get to your fourth missile, he'll start shooting um, lasers at you in a quadruple pattern. Just to point out. Be sure to take notes, you'll be great on this, you can just pause through the video. Yeah, about four missiles in, he's going to start shooting these quad laser rockets that go to you in a diagonal pattern and spin. So even if you're like underneath the platform, he'll still go. Anyway, here's a perfect run. 
There's also something else I have to keep in mind, is that it takes a long time for the missiles to circle around and actually hit the Pope. Sometimes they can be instantaneous and you can see all three of them hit at once, sometimes uh, it takes like a real time depending on where you are. Like I got lucky this one time and I don't know if you really need six, but I ended up hitting him six times in the end of quitting. So like right there, he didn't even show off the missiles. It's silly. Yeah, six missiles, and they're even all in the same place. I don't think you would need that seventh one, but hey, there you go. And right here is basically just the last episode of the f first chapter. As you can see, the Pope is a little bit upset. And you notice that uh, white line right there? Yeah, you can't go past it until you kill the Pope. It's interesting too. I think they just make this level for a little bit of closure for the guy, really. I don't think they really need to do that. They got it for uh, the wizard, but they don't have it. Anyway, that's the first chapter. I hope you all enjoyed this little uh, tutorial here. And it helped, if it helped you out, please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed it, because I will be uploading more. And I'll see you in the next chapter, when we take on the Orange World, uh, World 2. See you next time.